Hello again everyone. Well, we recently made a bit of a disturbing discovery about the motorhome. When we've been out and about camping, we've been locking up the van when we go out by just using the lock on the habitation door here. See? Pretty secure, right? Hmm. Well, not so really, because it turns out you can open that lock with almost any item you choose. The arm of my safety glasses, for instance. Now that's a bit of a worry, of course, because it's not difficult to imagine a scenario where we might be on a campsite and a asteroid from outer space crashes nearby, bringing with it a virus which triggers the zombie apocalypse. Anyone who prior to that was wearing safety glasses could enter our van and Nikki and I would be doomed to join the ranks of the bloodthirsty undead. So you can see it's important to sort this out, not just for our safety, but for the benefit of the whole of mankind. Now I'm guessing inside that lock, the little pin things, the tumblers, whatever, not really a locksmith, are jammed just through the lock, sort of being old and dried out maybe. So I think before we get too involved, the first thing might be to spray it with some sort of penetrating oil. And as you know, you can't really get much better than Plus Gas. Now, I'm not sponsored by Plus Gas, but Plus Gas, if you're listening, send us as much as you like, because uh, this is good stuff. Right, let's leave that a while, see if that has any effect. Well, I tell you, well, I've left that a while, and... Right, that's locked, so there you go, we can't get in, can't undo it, but uh, let's use a different key, any old key, let's use the ignition key, that's clearly the wrong key for this lock, turn that that way, and yeah, it's still locked, turn it, oh, yeah, it's still locked. I wonder if that's worked. Okay, so finish unlocking with the key. And we're in. Right, so let's try that again. So, lock the door. Yep, yeah, that's pretty locked. Maybe I'll just use the corner of that. Yeah, can't turn that. So yeah, that is securely locked. So I think just lubricating that lock has solved our problems. So there you go, just a short video and a pretty easy fix, but it just goes to show you uh, worth checking your locks if you have an older motorhome like us, because you might think it's working, but in actual fact, you can open it with almost anything. Now, we do use other latches on that lock from the inside when we're leaving the motorhome now. And I think I'm going to look into what extra security we could get to fit on that door. We use other security devices in the van as well as the immobiliser. But obviously when you're on the campsite, you do have an element of your own personal property. We don't carry a great deal. But we do carry some stuff and we wouldn't want anyone to be able to easily get in to have a way with it. Now I'm not going to show you all the security we have on the van for obvious reasons. I'm sure all my subscribers are fine upstanding fellows but uh, you never know some naughty burglar chap might be watching so I'm not going to give away everything that we do to secure the van but uh, I just wanted to show you that you can't necessarily rely on uh, the old habitation door lock to secure yourself. Well that's all for now. If you enjoyed it, press like. Subscribe if you want to see some more. And ring the bell to be 
be notified when we upload something new.